Thanks for rolling up. I'm Tuba Marley and this is Certified Pothead. Light coming in crazy and shit. Um, rolling up one of my uh, one of my uh morning splits and shit, yo. We about to uh to take a look at this um video. Do one of these uh reaction joints and shit. Oh, um, let's go ahead and jump in and shit, bro. Uh, let's see what we got today, bro. What is this? What is this? ain't they like ain't these like thirteen year olds, bro? Teens put smoke shop on blast for selling them weed. Yo, they they look. They look way too young to be to be smoking, bro. We don't we don't advocate around here for youngins for youngins smoking and shit. So, yeah, we not we not we not with that. Let's see let's see what's happening, bro. My friend went to the store to buy weed, and he was gonna sell it to us, and we're minors to smoke shop. Well, like, they sell it to minors. They so sell it to minors. They don't even ask for your age. They just give it to you. They go to store. <laughs> Hold on, bro. <laughs> Hold on, bro. Yo, um, all right, all right. Um, yo, if you uh, if you selling selling weed, the youngin', bro, you 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 piece of shit, bro. Now that being said, bro. These youngins, bruh, putting putting everything on blast, bruh. Putting everything on blast. These these niggas need to, these niggas need to be booked though. They need to be booked if they selling if they selling weed selling weed weed to little kids and shit. They need to be booked for that. Or something, and he didn't take anything. It was a grown, it was two grown men that beat up a thirteen year old that was on the floor. He had a bat that had nails in it, and he yeah. was gonna hit us with it. He was chasing us. He actually people. tried to swing it at them. Yeah. No, he no, stole they thought he candy, candy, a like, dollar candy. So he, so he jumped it. Me and my friend, we, we went in there to buy weed, right? He didn't ask for any up, age, nothing. He just came over here and said, "Oh, here." He gave it to us, like he literally gave it to us in another smoke shop. It's on fucking Seventeenth Street. Oh, can we get? Good lord, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, yo, somebody going down, bro. Somebody going down, bro. They need to go down, though, bro. Cause if you, if you, if you out here, bro. If you out here, bro. Um, and you selling weed? You selling weed to minors, bro? You need to go to the who scout, bro. You need to go to the who scout. Yeah, we ain't never, we ain't never advocated for nothing like that, bro. This is, this is crazy. Like a dime for five dollars. He said, yeah, here, he gave it to us. Like, these are fucking, like, not like legal weed shops selling kids to fucking, selling weed to minors and knowing that you're going to get in trouble. And they still called the fucking cops. I'm surprised he didn't get in trouble. Yeah, they said, he tried they to didn't lock him up. It didn't. He tried to beat him. He tried to hit him with a baseball bat with nails and stuff. They, they tried to, <laughs> they was trying to get, get this thing fucked up, bro. He said, yo, this motherfucker, bruh, try to fuck my homie up, bruh. Good lord, man. Crazy out here, bruh. Yo, yo, if you was younger, bruh, don't be trying to smoke weed, bruh. Know what I mean, wait till you, wait till you of age, bruh. We don't, we don't advocate nothing like that around here, bruh. We don't, we don't advocate nothing like that, bruh.